Chandler Jackson, uh, sophomore. Hunter Pratt, sophomore. Zion Noins, uh, sophomore. Eli Fetterman, junior. Colin Cyphers, junior. Adam McCarley, junior. Colin Beatty, junior. Nick Stokes, junior. Sam Lakey, junior. Harrison Kelly, junior. Bruce Mullen, junior. Kenneth Chanel, senior. Russell Winkle, senior. Sam Spence, senior. Spencer Stonecker, senior. Sports fans, I'm your host Leon Taylor with I Love Sports Game Day, and today we're at Christian Brothers High School with the head coach, Coach Lucky. How you doing? Doing great. How are you? Great, great. Now, Coach, you got a big season coming up, and let's talk about it. How you feel about it? Oh, I feel pretty good about it. They're all big seasons, though, really, but uh, I think we have some high expectations. It's not a very big team, but we like our guards and the guys that uh, everybody can handle the ball, and uh, we think we've got some good shooters, and uh, I think we can present some problems to our opponents too. You got a big time schedule coming up. Sure do. Yeah, let's talk about it. Well, you know, there have been times when uh, we've won a lot of games, but we weren't tested enough during the year. And we went a route this year where uh, for us to really do something special, we're going to have to line it up with the best teams possible that we could play. And, we're going to play the number one team out of Missouri in early January that has uh, one of the top guards in the country. He's been offered by Duke and Kentucky. Uh, Wooddale's got a really good team. That's who we open up with. Uh, White Station has a really good team. Cordoba has a good team. And we're playing in some classics. Uh, this is a crazy thing from a coaching standpoint. We have we had 14 games on our schedule that we didn't know who our opponents were, but we just knew that they're going to be good because they weren't going to be invited. So we, we've gone out on a limb and said, okay, we're going to line it up and have probably the best schedule we've ever had and uh, hope that the types of teams we play are going to prepare us for uh, what's really important, our league play and state tournament. And now, how do you feel about this tough schedule coming up? Uh, you know, it's good. Coach Lucky told me, told me earlier, probably during the summer, that we were going to have one of the toughest schedules we've ever had. Uh, this year, and I, uh, I was assuming it's because they feel uh, we as a team can handle it. Uh, this is probably one of the best teams uh, we're going to have in a while. So, uh, you know, it, I'm, I'm ready for it. We're ready. I think the coaches prepare us very well. But we're going to be the most conditioned, and I think we can pull some games out that nobody, think we'll, nobody thinks we'll win. Now, what are your expectations for this season for Christian Brothers? year, win 20 plus games again, do better than we did last year, make it further than we did last year, make it a Lipscomb championship game at least, at least one of four, but championship games where we want to be and then win it at all. What makes this team different from the others? I think this team, uh, yeah, I, I, we've got two division one guards. And uh, I think that we have a lot of guys that have skills. Uh, one of the things that some of our graduates have come back and said is they can't believe the skill level of our, our guys. We, we put a lot of time into skill development. And uh, I think that uh, that's what separates this team from some teams. That, but, but I've had a lot of good teams. Uh, uh, but, but this team is, is quick, and we have multiple guys that can score. Yes, sir. If you had to describe this team with one word, what would it be? Hmm. Uh, I'd probably say uh, fun. This is a fun. This is a fun team. A very fun, loving team. Uh, you know, off the court, we're all really good friends. Always uh, joking around and stuff. On the court, uh, you know, there's not a lot of selfishness. Uh, I think we like we like playing together a lot. We mesh pretty well. So uh, yeah, I'd say fun. I just like teammates. I love everybody on the team. Fun, practices be fun, play Final Five is fun, you have good times, you just have good times in the locker room. Then when it gets to the game, we're serious, and then they put it all out, I pull it all out with them. What do you feel like your role is? Uh, so I, I think, obviously, we're going to find ourselves in a lot of tough situations. It's not going to be smooth sailing. Uh, on the court, I think I need to be a kind of uh, level-headed, guy who can uh, keep us keep us grounded when we're too high or you know keep us up when we're too low 
um, and you know keep us steady throughout a game because games go up and down all the time. And if we if we just stay steady as a team, I think we can accomplish a lot. Yes, sir. Now, what can we expect for you on the court this season? Whole lot of buckets. Whole yeah. lot of buckets. Yeah. Whole lot of buckets. Scoring everywhere. Yes, sir. It's one of the things you love playing for your coach. Uh, he. Let's, he lets everybody just play. He doesn't really call plays. He let us play. Like last year, we really didn't have set plays that we did. He just let us play. Four out, one in, just let us play. And we did good last year and probably going to do something like that again this year, but with five guards. For the parents that are watching, what will be the reason for them to send their child to Christian Brothers High School? Well, number one is I think we are, I believe we're the best at turning boys into men. When they come here, they're boys. And when they leave, they're, they're ready for the next phase of their life. And uh, I think that the connections they have with as many years as our school has been around, the, the graduates that provide job opportunities and everything else for them, uh, the percentage of students that get uh, accepted into the college that they want to go to is, is super high. Uh, I think we do a really good job of providing them with a great environment. They're prepared for college and life when they get out of here.